Welcome back to the channel, football fans. Welcome. The Super Eagles are back in the country after their goalless draw. The Afghan qualifiers out there in Rwanda and they're back in the country. The news making headlines isn't really about the players. What's been going around the news is Augustine Oeguavon. As at last night, news were featuring in and rumors about Augustine Aguavon quitting his role as the interim manager of the Super Eagles. And lots of even verified and reliable sources even shared it online and on their platforms about Augustine Aguavon making statements that he was only mandated to handle the two games, the one against Benin Republic, which he won three goals to nil, and the game against Rwanda which ended goalless and in the in the rumors it was said that he has stepped down as an interim coach and the super eagles the nff will go on to continue searching and hunting for a new a new head coach but later today he has debunked all that and he, he's also made it clear that it's totally untrue and why the NFF is still in search of a new head coach. He is still saddled with the responsibility of handling the Super Eagles. And he has made it clear that he is still in charge of the Super Eagles. And now that he's back in the country, he will go into talks with the NFF on how to move forward and how to handle the next two games. So guys, the news about Augusto Guavon stepping down as the interim manager, his interim coach of the Super Eagles is totally untrue. Augustine Eguavo still is still in charge of the Super Eagles and he has actually done a very good job with seeing the renewed energy in the Super Eagles, their style of play. He has played with, with a three-man three, three -man defense and the midfield has also been solid. The Super Eagles have struggled um, in recent times to score goals and against Benin Republic the Spurs scored three good goals and unfortunately against Rwanda we couldn't get on the score sheet even though there was a goal that was disallowed and lots of controversy about the disallowed goal but but what I'm trying to say is that the Super Eagles has there's there's been this new energy in the Super Eagles. We saw how they resumed to, to camp very early for the international break and there's been this whole new vibe around the Super Eagles and Personally, I would think I I would I, I would want Augustine Eguavon to to continue and for him to be made the permanent head coach of the Super Eagles instead of going in search of a foreign manager or, or going back to square one to get another local or home base manager another local local manager and wish the NFL should give Augustine Eguavon a chance and. And I don't think the Afcon qualifier is is going to be so difficult for him not to qualify. He's going to qualify with the way this team has been set up and with the renewed energy in, in the team. The NFF should just give him the role as a head coach and he should continue the job he has he has started. So guys, I'd like to hear your thoughts in the comment section. What do you think? About Gustin Eguavon? The rumors, the own the rumors has been slashed by him and he is still the interim manager the interim coach of the super egos so guys drop your thoughts in the comment section would you want the nff to let him continue as a head coach or should they continue their search for a new head coach or a foreign coach just drop your thoughts in the comment section if you're new to the channel don't forget to like subscribe show us on support help us with 10,000 subscribers subscribers before the end of the year see you in the next one Cheers.